I'm so hungry this morning, and that just <laughs> added to the hunger. Yeah. Any, of, any of that look good, right? I know. Healthy options can be yummy, too. Uh, absolutely, yeah. We are looking at some healthy weather for today. <laughs> Get a little vitamin D outside, perhaps, uh, in the sunshine. Uh, we are looking at the chances for rain to go up a little bit over the next couple of days, specifically on Sunday. But today, tomorrow, I think are primarily dry. Monday, Labor Day, low chance of any rain and that'll continue right into the middle part of next week. Obviously Sunday kind of stands out there. We'll go over the timing of those showers in just a second. Blue skies over the city of Providence on our amp cam. Here's our Lincoln camera. Blue skies here as well. 57 degrees wind from the north northeast at five dew point at 56. So we're still in the comfortable level as far as the humidity with the dew points in the 50s. Threat tracker right through the weekend. Yeah, we do have the chance for rain showers on Sunday. I don't think they're going to be overly impactful, but uh, you might want to plan around them. We are looking at a wedge of dry air kind of working its way right across southern New England, keeping those clouds and showers out. We have a frontal system across the Great Lakes that'll be coming on through throughout the weekend. So let's time out the clouds and showers with that system today. Looking at sunshine, no problems at all with that wedge of dry air in place. As we go into your Saturday, partly to mostly sunny, we're dry tomorrow. And as we go into late Saturday night, and especially on Sunday morning, there's a chance for some rain showers. As you can see, we're not looking at a widespread heavy rain, but there will be some rain showers pushing on through the area. And as we go into the afternoon, I think the trend will be for us to be drier. But look, quick little shower, certainly possible Sunday afternoon. And then as we go into Monday, all this clears out, looking a lot better for Labor Day. So I wouldn't cancel any afternoon plans on Sunday, but there could be an additional shower or two. This morning, sunshine, temperatures climbing back through the 50s, 60s, getting into the low 70s by noontime. Let's pinpoint the afternoon across the area for today. About 69 degrees there in Matunic, 72 in Portsmouth over in Tiverton, Little Compton, about 72. Low 70s, Hope Valley and Westerly heading on up into Kent County, Providence County, Bristol County, Rhode Island, about 73 in Situate, 70 in Foster, East Greenwich today about 74, Providence right around 73 degrees. In the uh, Bristol County, Massachusetts area, about 74 in Mansfield, North Attleboro, 74, Sunshine in Fall River today, I'm thinking you'll have a high around 71, 72 in New Bedford. Out on the beaches today, sunny, Pleasant day. It'll be nice and dry with temperatures getting into the low 70s in the afternoon. Out on the bay, winds will slowly turn more southeasterly as we head into the afternoon. About 5 to 10 knots or so. Uh, waves small. Low tide is at about 1130 this morning. Now for tonight, some extra clouds late in the night. Overnight low temperatures getting down to around 60 degrees. Here's that seven day forecast. Again, there's that chance of showers sat uh, Sunday morning. Maybe an additional shower in the afternoon. Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, delightful 70s with sunshine. Morning lows early next week. Kids going back to school in the 50s. Kind of cool. Full forecast. We've always got that for you, including our exclusive Weather Now videos where we chat about the weather. It's on our Pinpoint Weather 12 app. Here's Melissa with one final check of your Friday.